also want to consider when transitioning careers is your idea. Is your idea unique? Does it offer a service to consumers that you know they will benefit from and that uh, only you will be able to offer? Are you a purple cow? I know it sounds kind of crazy, but somebody recommended this book to me, and basically it talks about how you have to be a standout. You have to offer something unique and original that no one else can offer. That's the only way that your product will succeed in today's world. With the internet and everything going on and with big businesses like Walmart, you as a small business or even just pitching your idea to a manager need to stand out and come out with unique original material. One excerpt in the book that I'd like to share this, the author Seth Godin, he wrote about, um, really put things in perspective me, so I really want to share it with you. So he says, when my family and I were driving through France a few years ago, we were enchanted by the hundreds of store-but cows grazing the picturesque pastures right next to the highway. For dozens of kilometers, we all gazed out the window, marveling about how beautiful everything was. Then, within 20 minutes, we started ignoring the cows. The new cows were just like the old cows, and what once was amazing was now common. Worse than common, it was boring. Cows, after you've seen them for a while, are boring. They may be perfect cows, attractive cows, cows with great personalities, cows lit by beautiful light, but they're still boring. A purple cow, though, now that would be interesting, at least for a while. So it really just explains how, you know, you can, you can wrap it up as pretty as possible, but, you know, if you have something that everyone else has seen and done, it's not going to sell. So come up with something creative, unique, and that your consumers will benefit from.